Hello everyone, this is Suresh. Welcome to my channel. In this session, I'm going to show you how to automate delete API using a REST Assured. In the last sessions, we have seen get, post, put and patch APIs. In this session, we'll see how we can uh, use this delete API using a REST Assured. And before we begin, we need to understand what is a delete API. So delete API is generally used to delete a resource from a database or, or from a server. So this is as similar as our database uh, delete command. So it will delete a, a particular uh, details of employee, right? So similarly, this delete API will work similarly to that. And this will has different uh, status codes coming in whenever we use this uh, delete API like 202, 204 and 200 status. Okay. So where 202 is an uh, accepted, where 204 is a generally that we used to see whenever we delete any data which is a no content and 200 status code if everything goes well it will gives you 200 status code success and this is a sample url that we are going to hit and to delete this api so let's jump into the postman for the manual task so in this we have here url so this is url and the type is delete and once you hit enter and this will uh, this will not have any body to pass here because we are already passing in the endpoint that user is a id number two so that user needs to be deleted from the database right so once you hit send you can see 204 no content that means there is no data in database everything goes well and data has been removed from the database and similarly if we go to our eclipse id and in the rest test sheet we will be coding the similar way and we will be getting this 204 so let's open Eclipse IDE and this is the last session that we have followed and uh, let me do this enable equal to false so that uh, it will not execute again. So this is a test ng project right so we need a test annotation and test annotation under that we have public void delete. Right, so this is a method name, and we need a REST assured class to handle our base URI. REST assured dot base URI. So this is the base URI, and we need to provide the base URI, right? So this is my base URI. This is a string type that we need to pass, then after we need a request specification. So request specification and uh, we need to provide some reference to this request specification equal to rest assured dot given. So this command allow us to do the operations under this request specification that we are going to do pass headers body and the methods right. So under this request specification so we no need to have to pass any body here so we need to directly pass the method. So method will be available once we declare response response interface. So using this response interface, I need to call https dot request dot request. Right under request, we need to have we need to pass the method. METH method. Yeah, under this method we have delete. Right? So delete what we are trying to delete from the resource. So we are trying to delete from the resource is this it's user two. Right? right? So once we have this, and here we don't have anything like it will not give you any response so we no need to capture the response as well we can add an assertion on the status code like int status code status code equal to response response interface reference dot get status code right we can add assertion on this so test ng asset dot asset equals integer type and my status code should be 204 
0.04 and we can have a status line also here so string so we have here status line code already defined here so i can copy that status line right this is a status line that i'm expecting so this should be 204 this is not okay this should be no content right quickly save and run right click run as test ng test so everything goes well our entire system is giving the right solution right we have a status code 204 and no content if i remove this one so let me see the failure case for this right there will be one condition failure it's a status line right so this is a status line it should be 204 no content right so our delete api is working correctly right so this is how we handle our delete api using uh, rest assured i hope this session is useful for you in case if you are new to my channel do subscribe to my channel do like share comment there are more sessions coming up stay tuned thank you Thank you.